in this week in Outlander history, Vengeance is Mine. The storyline some of us wondered had been forgotten came back up in Outlander history this week. Vengeance is Mine brought the Duke of Sandringham back in play and Murtaugh finally made up for his mistake. Remember back in Paris when Mary and Claire were attacked? It was the night of the dinner party when Mary was raped and everyone thought it was Alex Randall. Well, that storyline returned in Outlander history this week. June 18th was the first time Outlander Season 2, Episode 11, titled Vengeance is Mine, aired on Stars. The Jacobites returned north, as happened during the 45 Jacobite Rebellion. The clans couldn't agree on the next course of action. Despite their successes, they weren't sure about taking on London. Had they continued, they would have possibly won but, as Outlander showed us, they broke apart and went back north. This was something touched on in Vengeance's mine. However, it wasn't just a simple trip north. Jamie, Dougal, Rupert, Claire, and others were stopped by British soldiers and had no choice but to hide in an abandoned building with British soldiers surrounding them. They were able to get out only because they used Claire as an English prisoner and agreed to hand her over for their own safety. Claire gets a message to Jamie. Everyone thought they knew where the British would send Claire but she soon finds out that the place isn't right. Fortunately, Human Row is an earshot as Claire learns the full details and that allows her to get a message to Jamie. This is where she runs into an event of the past. Her captor is the Duke of Sandringham, who claims he is also being held prisoner. She manages to get another message to Jamie in extremely bad Gaelic but then realizes that the Duke's manservant has the birthmark she spotted the night she was attacked in Paris. Finally, all the pieces come together. The Duke had sent his servants out to attack Mary and Claire. Mary is also there and attempts to help Claire's bid for freedom but it looks like it will fail. Fortunately, Murtaugh and Jamie got the message and Murtaugh got there in time to kill the Duke and offer the Duke's head to the woman. I'm sure Claire would have loved that war prize. Outlander Season 2 Episode 11 isn't my favorite episode of the season but it at least gave Murtaugh the chance to feel like he wasn't a failure. He'd got his vengeance after being knocked out the night Claire and Mary were attacked. 